welcome to a work day in my life. So today is an exciting one because we're actually going to visit the GitHub office in San Francisco. Um, for those of you who are new, we're working remotely on a road trip. So I'm really excited to take you guys along with me to the office. Kind of like working in an office even though it's not technically my company's office and it just so happens that we just arrived in san francisco today um, i'm gonna do the work vlog tomorrow um first things first we're just gonna get some dinner first time in san francisco so i'm really excited to take you guys along with me all right we're scooting to dinner for session guys it's the electric car it's limo little alleyway of Chinese zodiac and Yo, different things. It's still in 2022, but you know, other cool stuff here. The other into street art. And then I'm gonna get that. You're not gonna have leftover. Yo, you know what? Or Michelin star recommended in 2015. We just finished. Now we're gonna walk off our food before we head back. There might be some dessert like for me. I know I'm not eating anymore, bro. Yeah. Gosh, I love this call. <laughs> These two are like my childhood. Okay. <laughs> See, the problem is God gives me oh, no, but only enough blood to run when I San Francisco shirt. My cousin top video. Oh. Cool. Yeah. How cool. Oh. Wow. Cafe mall. Wow. Wow. How cool. Stickers. You don't know what they look like. <laughs> wait, look oh. at this one. Wait, I, oh wait, I, I've never seen this one before. This is the snack area. <gasps> Stickers. There's even a bar. Who's a little ping pong table? A bunch of cool wall art, little bits and bites. This honestly makes me miss working in an office a little bit, but my previous company's office was not this cool. Um, I think my current company's office is also very cool, but it's who knows when I'm gonna have a chance to visit that. I love it. Snacks and drinks. This one looks really good too. They have like some kind of still water that's flavored and then more seating area like i'm assuming this is how a lot of tech companies now are they're very empty even during the work hours because people are just working from home if commute was better i feel like it'd be better but the shop area has like pins some stickers um that looks like a conference room and then this one, there's like a really cool little design here. I wanna take a picture next to that GitHub sign before I go. 
but there's this like standing this front area has a cafe I just want to be wary of people I don't want to unintentionally film something but yeah isn't this office so cool it would actually make me want to come into the office every once in a while if it was like close by to me and the commute wasn't like an hour long which actually was the case when I worked in office my commute was about 40 minutes which included like 20 minutes of walking Hidden GitHub room. Wow. Wow. Who works in here? Wow. It's like an Easter egg. So much character, so empty. But granted, we are here on a Friday, and I think that's why. Offices are pretty empty for remote first companies, I guess. But I think, the guys, they brought pizza for the employees. Oh, I'm not a carnivore. It's a lot of pizza, how are they gonna finish it? Where are the employees? Yeah, where are they? They're not here. They, we went upstairs. Not a single soul. So there might be there with us. No wonder you guys are negative. No <laughs> wonder. Imagine this pizza looks strong. Is that a room in your bag for snacks? They're gonna say no, but I don't know why. So we just got back from the office. It was very cute, but it was also very empty. Well, it's a Friday, so it makes a lot of sense. I feel like a lot of people will come in like beginning of the week or the middle of the week and then just not come in on Fridays. But the cafe area is really cool. And we also grabbed snacks before we left. Honestly, I think that was a good experience. It makes me want to go to my office, my company's office. But I don't know when I will have that chance. But we're going to go to the Bay Bridge. The Golden Gate Bridge. I don't know the exact name. I think it's the Golden Gate. But it's not golden. It's like red. Or maybe it used to be golden. Because we were originally deciding between the gate and Salesforce Tower. But then I was like, why are we such tech bros? After a long, hard day. Bella and Koji finally getting the break that they deserve. Dude, where is the bridge? It's just there. supposed to be there. It's a shy bridge. There's so much foggy over here. Yeah. Apparently, the cloud or the fog that goes into San Francisco Bay that shows up like random times of the day is called Carl. Here it is. We're gonna have a It's a little bit more visible now. Man, look at this fog. There's the Palace of Fine Art. Guys, look at these beautiful houses. What the heck? They all have giant ass windows. Dude, next time you just gotta spend like 10 days here. Like, wow. And then you don't see it a single time. This area reminds me of Japan <laughs> a little bit. I don't know why. I didn't really experience it. Right, we are back. Look at Bella. She is so cute right now. Bella! <gasps> She's always cute. Mm, you yeah, always cute. Yeah, really okay, so I think I'm gonna close out the vlog here because it's already like 8 o'clock EST. Even though it's. Okay, look. 
Okay, you can't see it, but it's still bright outside. So it's like five o'clock local time, eight o'clock EST, and I'm about to shower and sleep. Honestly, I would highly recommend doing this like living in EST time on the West Coast because first you wake up early for everything. So like if you go to a tourist attraction, there's usually no one else there, usually. Okay, there's not, like, some people, but it's very minimal. And you also wake up in time for breakfast. Since we're staying at like hotels and lodges and stuff, we're usually the first to line up for breakfast, which I guess doesn't make that big of a difference, but you get, it, it might be slightly cleaner because you're the first one to get breakfast, I don't know. But you also make the most out of daylight because when I stop working at 5 p.m. EST, local time is only two o'clock. So even though I sleep still at like 10 or 11 EST, I don't, like we're basically still outside when the sun is out. Okay. Bye. Liquid death. Uh, in a path bottle. Yes.